Hello everyone, I'm Nick Terranova and welcome back to the joy of coloring. Today, you know, in the spirit of DY, we're going to be drawing a dolphin, you know, because that's DY's mascot, so let's make a beautiful little picture of that. So to start off, we're going we're gonna to kind of create the environment, you know, kind of create the background. And you know, of course, dolphins, they live in the ocean, so let's draw the ocean. Now, a lot of people, they kind of think of the, the ocean as, you know, blue, but in my kind of artistic vision, I see it as, you know, an emerald green kind of area, you know? So that's why we're going to be starting off with the green, you know, color. I mean, if you, if you prefer blue, you, by all means, you're allowed to do that, you know? We, we can all make our own choices in life. But today, I'm going to be using green. So let's start off with, you know, some nice calm waves, you know? Some nice, nice relaxing ocean. There we go, there we go, and you know, as this is a pretty, pretty relaxed ocean, make sure to, make sure to go very gently here, you know? Nice, 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 nice. And you know, now that we have our ocean, let's start drawing our dolphins, right? And so, to start off, let's, you know, just start with the head, you know? Start, start at the top, get to the bottom, you know? So, uh, just gonna kind of give them a head. Dolphins, you know, they kind of have that almost triangular, you know, it kind of comes out into a bottle, you know? So, you can start with almost like a triangle kind of shape. That's what we got here. And their body, you know, it kind of comes down into like a cylinder, ovalish type shape. So, you can add that next. Nice. And then, at the bottom, they kind of fork off, you know, into their little tail ends. So let's draw that there. And then next, where you have your kind of head, meet the body, give them, give them a little dorsal fin. I always like the dorsal fins on dolphin, you know, it reminds me of a little mohawk. So next, we're going to draw them their little fins that they use for swimming, you know. I guess they're actually the big fins. And then uh, lastly, let's finish it off with a big old smile. Nice, that's a happy dolphin. You're probably wondering, why is that dolphin so happy? Well, that's because he's out there on a beautiful day, swimming in the ocean with his best friend. So let's draw his best friend right now, right? So again, same process. Just start with, you know, the kind of head. And then you can come down to the body. And then the body comes into the little feet, I guess. Then give them a little dorsal fin. And then two, you know, bigger fins. Lastly, a big old smile. Nice, nice. And then, you know, lastly, to kind of round this image out, let's get some, uh, let's get some of the, you know, rest of the environment. Let's give them a big old sun, all right? Nice, big old sun just shining down. It's a beautiful day. And uh, lastly, up in the sky, you know, it's a beautiful day, not a cloud in the sky. So in the sky, let's put some birds. All right, all right. Good, good. There we go. I think that came out pretty wonderful. Now, lastly, you know, it's your work. Put your name on it. Be proud of your work, you know? Even if you don't think it turned out so well, I'm sure someone else is out there that can appreciate it. So, you know, let them appreciate you. Be proud of yourself. And now when signing your work, you know, you can sign it wherever you prefer. I like to go at the top, personally, because, you know, when I look at, you know, painting a picture, whatever, photograph, I start at the bottom, kind of, you know, start at the base and build it up, you know? And so I like to take in the whole beauty and then take in the name of the creator, you know? So I'm going to go for the top corner right here. And, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yep. And nice, nice. Whoa! Oh, shoot. You know, I think, I think it might have smudged a little bit, but you know, that's, that's all right. I mean, accidents happen. You just kind of got to, you know, take what you get from it. So, um, this is our final product. I mean, 
you know, it, I, I think it, I kind of preferred it before it smudged, but I think this is okay too, you know? I'm happy with this. I can live with this. Um, so hey, you know, if one life hands you lemons, one life knocks down your easels, you just gotta kind of roll with it. So anyways, that's gonna conclude this episode of The Joy of Coloring. Uh, make sure to tune in next time. Thank you.